Hi, I'm Dr. Luke Rasmussen. I'm an orthopedic surgeon at the Orthopedic Institute in Sioux Falls, South Dakota. In fellowship, I was trained on the uh, ROSA robot for knee replacement, the Mako robot, as well as Corey. All of these robots, the idea is to take the patient's anatomy, build a 3D model, and then use the tools, the robot itself, to perform that knee replacement very accurately. Because we are building a 3D model, we can actually plan interoperatively uh, or before the surgery exactly how we're going to position those implants to mirror the patient's individual anatomy. And then during the procedure itself, use the 3D model and the patient's native anatomy to test and see once this knee replacement is in, how is it going to move? It allows me to be highly accurate in how I position the implant, what the patient's natural flexibility and laxity is, and then match that at the time of the case, as well as to predict when natural aberrations to anatomy are and plan accordingly when it comes to implant selection and what instruments I need available at the time of surgery. When we say uh, robotic knee or hip replacement, we don't mean that the robot performs the surgery. Rather, the robot is a tool in the surgeon's hand that allows him to be more accurate. The robot scans in real time where the patient's anatomy is and allows us to position cuts on a computer screen and then accurately perform those cuts in real life. Effectively, the robot takes what's on a 3D model and allows us to recreate that on the patient's anatomy. The benefit is high accuracy, preoperative planning, and interoperative performance. Robotics knee replacement allows the surgeon to be highly accurate in the way that they plan as well as perform the knee replacement so we can have the best outcomes when it comes to our patients. 